Okay, start. Now, how loud are you, buddy? Barely. <laughs> do, do, do. And I know you're going to be getting a lot louder, so I'm just going to turn you all the way down. Please, thank you. Probably can go a little lower. Up. There we go. Up. Do, do, do. The crits have been unlucky. So let's ruin one up there. to actually get rid of the rest of the Pokemon stuff, don't I? Get rid of you, you, and that folder. There we go. Why don't we do Hotline Miami for a bit then, just as a uh, trick for spookiness with Halloween. Lost the left button to punch, aim for the face. Once you've talked about now, you can finish them. Do this press space. Okay, that's actually decently easy controlled. What? Oh, I only had to do one. Weird. Should try killing the next guy. Use the bat in the red room. Press the right flex button when next to take out. Press the left button the mouse and swing it. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty easy to do, almost man. So give me that. There we go. Then a gun, probably the same thing. Same we picked up the bat, press the right mouse button, use shift to look for enemies. Okay. You can press the scroll wheel to lock on to enemies. Oh, I didn't know there was a lock up in this game, actually. That's good to know. Left button to shoot, go and kill the guy in the other room. Guess we can do that with just any weapon, but there we go. Then this guy in here. Goodbye. Right, that sums up the basics. There's always more tricks to learn. You can throw any weapon you pick up by pressing your right mouse button again. You can use doors to knock enemies over. Guns are loud and will alert your foes, so play your moves and use your melee weapons when you can. Uh, you'll just get yourself killed, won't you? Oh, we'll be fine. We're a chicken. I think. So, here we are. And who do we have here? Oh, you don't know who we are? Maybe we should just leave it that way. But I know you. Look at my face, we've met before, haven't we? I don't know you. Why are you here? You're no guest of mine. Do you really want me to reveal who you are? Knowing oneself means acknowledging one's actions. As of lately, you've done some terrible things. Hey, you don't remember me? I'll give you a clue. Does April the 3rd mean anything to you? I believe that was the first day of our first encounter. You look like you might be remembering something. Well, looks about right. So let's just wander around what I assume is our apartment. Oh, yeah. Hello. Yeah, one new message. Hi, it's this is Tim at the bakery. The cookies that you ordered should be delivered by now. A list of ingredients are included. Make sure that you read them carefully. Oh, cool. We got cookies. Oh, let's, let's talk cookies. That's a sheet of paper. Carter's is a briefcase discretion is of essence. Leave tonight this leave, to, leave target at point F32 inside the dumpster. Failure is not an option, we'll be watching. Okay, well, we got our first mission. I'm assuming that's just someone else's room, so that's fine. I guess let's just get into our car and have some fun. And then we've got some of the sweet music of this game alongside it. And I guess we've only got the option for Richard right now, so... Sure. Hello there. Wow. Oh. Right, we've got to actually click to actually get that going. Okay, that works. Then discretion matters. And I guess we're just by a train station. Okay. Oh, that didn't work. Okay. Gotta be a bit quicker about it. Pop up. Let's see here. 
You don't really have anything to take him out, do you? But oh, we got that. Right, the battle work. Oh, <laughs> the battle would help if I could actually throw it properly. There we go. Goodbye. Give me the bat. Let's see. There we go. That's the better. That's how you sneak attack things. Cool. Let's see here. Nope, that was dumb. Gotta remember to actually click. You need that. There we go. Goodbye to you. Give me that bet, please. Thank you. And then let's just be careful about you, because you seem to have a spike or a sword of some kind. Oh, that was dumb. <laughs> okay, so now that there's three. Hi, buddy. Much better. I'm just gonna get the fake guy up here. Or at least just out of view of him. There we go. That's one down at least. There is you, but are you gonna notice that? You are not gonna notice that, you're just gonna bleed. Cool, I mean, I'm fine with taking this a little bit slowly. I know that's not the exact intention, but... Oh. I did not notice you. Okay. That's fine. Hey, buddy. Much better. Then wait for you to swing on by. And we can do that. Although you're kind of just dead in the middle of the floor. Which is a bit of a concern. Hmm. I'm assuming I need to kill them all, though. So this isn't really an option right now. So what we do... Oh, that was a whiff. So we can probably just knock him out in the doorway and then chuck the bat at him. Do, do, do. There we go. And then, what? Much better. That's, oh. Didn't see people there. Okay. This is kind of why I see this game as more of a puzzle game compared to anything else, really. No. Just because, as long as you can optimize your actual kill strategy, it tends to be a little bit easier to actually get through it all. Hey, buddy. You need that. There we go. Thank you for coming up here. Give me that. Give me the pipe. Let's see here. Let's focus on you first. And then just pipe. Then you. We can throw the pipe. And goodbye. Then we gotta deal with what's up here exactly. Looks like three guys. But that is kind of the end of this, so... Discretion being important does matter. We really have to go right in through here. There we go. Give me the bat. Give me that. Anyways, hi buddy. You like coming out here? I guess not. Oh, that was dumb. I don't have a weapon, do I? Hey there. Where are you? There we go. That's better. And then you. Give me that. Much better. Now I just gotta get out, which at least is quick. Oh, the train. They're not dead. No, it. They are not dead yet. That's a concern. We just need to get to our car, though, don't we? Uh, we have to kill them. Lots of bit of problem. I guess I just have to be a great case I need to off them. Okay. That could be a little bit easier said than done. Oh, this isn't actually a killing weapon. That's a problem. Hmm. No. <laughs> Okay, so noted. Briefcase does not kill things instantly, so you gotta do that, and that. There we go, and get rid of you. Much better. Now we can leave by our car. Kinda weird that you have to absolutely kill everybody, but it works. Hmm. 
Do 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 do. Dash it. Here. Who's there? I can hear you. I know you're there. Oh. Don't mind me. Hi, random homeless man. Give me that. Well. Oh, he's not dead yet. Apparently he is now. Later, homeless guy. Oh. Well, that's not healthy for us at all. Okay. I guess that's kind of just what happens with us putting a mask on and murdering a whole bunch of people, so... Fair enough. No combo points, but I'm not exactly doing this the quickest in the world. Let's see, 22,000 out of 13,000? Cool. B. It's not bad for my first attempt at it. And we get the owl mask. Sweet. Well, hello there. Hey, the man haven't seen you around. Thought something might have happened to you. You seemed really down on losing your girlfriend. Don't remember seeing you after that. Maybe we should talk about something else. So, for a midnight snack, huh? Oh, don't worry about it. It's on the house. Good to see you. Have a nice night. Oh, well, thank you. Cool. Free snack from the corner store. I'm not going to pull that logic at the very least. Then five days later, we really get something, huh? Guy definitely has decent taste if he's driving pizza every night, although the eviction... Oh no, those are just subletters. Merrick gets a tune. Must be sung together. 50 blessings. Okay, so he listens to Christian Rock. That's a bit concerning. Hi, it's Linda. A new babysitter. Right away, got a few kids that need to be disciplined here. I'm at East 7th Street. Make sure you have a long talk with them. I really need someone to get through to these rascals. Like last time. Please be discreet. Sure, we can try to be as discreet as we can. Hello there, car. Let's see. First chapter, no talk. Be fast and efficient. Fast and efficient definitely matters, but... An eye for secrets. Compared to Richard, this is just nothing, so... Sure. East 7th Street. Let's see what we get. Just go up. That's fair. Let's see. Angry apartment complex, which is fair. Although, how do we take care of you? I don't know if there is a good way, actually. Hmm. There we go. We need that. Let's see, what's around here? Ooh, that looks fun. Wow. Give me that. What are you for? There we go. Oh, that's actually not great. There we go. Much better. And we just gotta deal with the gun. I was not paying attention to you. Okay. <laughs> gotta try that again then. Hey, buddy. Pop. You need the pipe. Wait on you to come on by. We can knock you through the door and goodbye. Technically we have a gun, but I don't think the guns are super efficient, really. Just give me the pipe. The pipe is slightly better. Hey, buddy. Hmm. Oh. That works. Somehow slurted blood into the other room, but didn't notify anyone. That's fine. Alright, so no bit there is a guy on the couch there. But he also decided to come into the room this time. Unlike last time, so that's a bit of a concern. Hmm. I'm assuming, yeah, you can't really wall clip in this game. That would be a little bit silly if you could. Mm -hmm. I suppose you want to notice that come out here. Oh no. You're actually leaving? Well, that helps me out a little bit. Hey, buddy boy. Nope. There we go. Goodbye. Can 
gonna take my pipe and be on my merry little way. Although we are taking it surprisingly slowly, and I'm not sure if the game likes that very much. Good amount for boldness, nothing for combos, because we're not exactly going fast. And then flexibility, mobility. That's not too bad. We doubled the point score. Although, hey, better grade too. Sweet. And we get Tony the Packer. Hi, buddy. I'm assuming you let us go faster. Oh, some good character sprites here. Hey there, welcome. Oh, you don't need to order. Your pizza's already done. Had a feeling you're on the way here. Well, let's just leave it at that for now, shall we? Don't worry about paying. It's on the house. Well, I mean, I'm down for pizza. I mean, who isn't down for pizza? All things considered. And a good touch to have the second pizza box. And I got the third pizza box as well, actually. Hmm. Yep, one new message. This is Thomas from the Met Methadone Clinic. We sh we've scheduled a short meeting for you tonight. We're at Northwest 184th Street at Apartment 105, and don't worry, we know discretion is of importance for clients. Well, I guess that's why we're getting the call, so let's see what the Northwest Street is like. Hey. Now what does Tony let us do? Overdose. Okay. Fair. Let's hit follow red rose. Fair. Fists of fury. So I guess our fists should kill. So we don't have to worry about anything. Hmm. That is good as a starting off point, technically. And it does tend to help a little bit, so... Hey, everybody. Wow. Let's see, a lot of guns so far. There we go. That's not great. Although, it's fine, apparently. And then, one guy in the launcher. Which, honestly, wow, give me that bad, please, and thank you. Looks like we can actually go up or down. Mm. And I almost thought that was the slut shirt from Valhalla, but not quite. One of these days we'll be able to get something like that. And where do you go on your path? Can I? There we go. Oh. <laughs> I had a buddy boy. I wasn't quite expecting you. Oops. Give me that. There we go. Okay, so gotta remember this gun man right there. Hey, buddy. There we go. Then we can get rid of him. Much better. Give me that. No, that's not good. There we go. That's not going to work. <laughs> Let's try that again. Goodbye. Give me a bat, please. Thank you. Oh, that don't have to work. I don't quite know how, but... There we go. Let's see. What's the best option for you? Probably waiting until you get away from the door. Yeah, I'm going to just kill you in the corner. That's a bit easier. And that almost looks like a gun there, but... There we go. Oh, that's real awkward. That's also exceptionally awkward. Okay, I didn't think there was a shotgun in there. Hmm. Hey, buddy boy. Oh, you didn't... Really, you didn't notice that? No. Oh. That's not good. <laughs> Oh, gotta hate those misclicks at times, but that's fine. Need that. There we go. And then you, sir, can stop. Because I feel like the less you use guns, that tends to just be better. Mm. Although that's a problem. That's a very large problem. You feel it coming up here, buddy? Because it's fairly obvious I'm right here. There we go. Easy enough. 
And there's gotta be a two in there, and I think one has a pipe once again, so it'll be easier to do that. A little bit easier, at least. Then you and one more. There we go. No, not one more. There we go. That's a bit better. Alright then. No briefcase or anything either, so. Pretty smooth sailing at least. And I'm surprised no one just notices this car everywhere. With the amount of dead bodies that we kind of rack up, but I suppose that works out pretty well. And we actually got combo points that time. And didn't actually no, doubling the score would have been 34,000, but still not too bad. Got a B minus. Could have done better, but I think the entire point is to combo and go a little bit quicker than what I'm doing. Hey, the samurai sword. Lovely. Alright, well, we'll go to the VHS store, which unfortunately not many of the younger generation will actually know what this is nowadays, but that's fine. Hey dude, good to see you again. Did you hear about the massacre the other night? Bunch of Ruskies I heard. No loss if you ask me. They say some maniac wearing a rubber mask did it. Sounds like a scene straight from a slasher flick. Oh yeah, I have a perfect film for you. Take one on the desk. Take it, it's on the house. Enjoy yourself, dude. Oh, give me that. That's also one of the things I probably should double check on, because I do still have a VHS player myself. But I haven't really used it in a good five to seven years, so I'm not sure how useful it actually is. Hi, it's Kate from the Hotline Miami Dating Service. We have set up a date for you this evening. She'll be waiting for you at so Southwest 53rd place. As usual, make sure you wear something fancy. <laughs> I like how discreet these calls are, because the wording is definitely perfect for them. Yoink. The third chapter, Decadence. Ooh, that's a good name for this. Because it's very satisfying when you can just take out everyone. More guns. I don't actually care about the guns, to be honest with you. I'll just keep Razmuth on. Because the Fist of Fury isn't that great with how we've been playing lately. There we go, give me that. And then just a straight gun right there. Hmm. So what's... Oh. <laughs> Okay, there's a gunman in the hall. That makes sense. Well, please die. Alright, so there's a shotgunner very deep in the hall. Nope. Oh. <laughs> nope, he noticed us before we actually got in there. Oh, okay. Much better. Now then, gunner boy. No, apparently he just notices the pipe coming to fly at him. I really don't want to use a gun if I don't have to, is the problem. There we go. Let's see here. Oh, is a knife here this time? And I do at least have a plan for this. We can knock the door into that one gun, then rush in on that one, knock him with a pipe, and then do that. There we go. That's smooth, at least. Now what else can I do here? Hmm. I'm assuming, yeah, he's still at the end of the hall there. It'll be better to get him just by going through this door here, but you're a problem. You're a huge problem. There we go. Now what are you gonna do there, buddy boy? You're gonna run around? Easier for me. Then oh, that was good. Apparently that guy's just making it easier to kill him too, so I'm fine with that. Oh, oh I picked up the knife. Okay. That's not too bad. Give me that. Let's see. Oh, that is a person. Do I need to kill him? I don't know if I need to kill him, actually. That would suck if I do, though. Oh, no, he's just a DJ. Cool. You don't have to worry about him. Don't have to stop the music. 
Oh, this is a problem. There we go. And then that will work because we just do real big. I missed the gun throw. Okay. There we go. Oh, that was bad. There we go. Now, I thought I could do it quickly, but I'd have to probably throw that fight there. There we go. Probably want to get rid of... Mm -hmm. Would be a good one to get rid of here. Probably the gun. There we go. Let's see. Just gotta get rid of... Ah, darn. Okay, so you can actually get a kill. Ooh. What did I do there? I like a space right away. Weird if I had to knock him down first. Okay. Well, this works. Bill. There we go. Goodbye to you. And then you seem to be active already. That's a bit weird. What do you feel like doing, buddy? Oh. That was that guy. That was the end shot. And wall shotgun guy. Okay. Ooh, AK to do that. There we go. And you. There we go. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. And then. Oh. That didn't work at all. I really gotta work on my aim with this thing. There we go. see here. Ooh, I did get a combo achievement there though, so that's good. There we go. Give me that. What? What? No, that didn't work. That didn't work at all. There we go. That kind of worked. Although that was very scuffed. Ah, darn. I'm curious if you can pretty much do it all in one, like, effort. There we go. But then this room is the concern. Because at least with your clicking speed, they don't really allow you to get three attacks off that quickly. Oh, that didn't work. There we go. You need that. And that was a mess. Noted. There we go. Give me pipe. Goodbye to you. Oh. Okay, that's fair. There we go. And let's see here. Where are you both? There we go. And that didn't notify you. Huh. That's a bit strange. Mm -hmm. Now, options here. There we go. That was it. Oh, just the first floor? Okay. Ooh, a cool queue. Like, oh, that's good. If I you. There we go. This is a lot more open than the last one. Oh. No, that's... That's a gun. No. That's a problem. Ow. Alright, so get rid of you immediately. Get rid of you immediately. Get rid of you. Okay, nope, that's bedroom of three. Noted. Get rid of you. At least have a safe room. There we go, that's better. Let's see here. Order of operations. Mm. This that would be pushing it, I think. There we go. That did not notify you. That does notify you, though. Okay. Probably should figure, but can never be too sure. Okay. No, I was not getting my angle off there, so that's fine. There we go. Then you, sir. 
enjoy seething down. I think if I open up that door, that does notify you, so... And, of course, doing that will notify you as well. That's fair. Oh. Well, that worked out a bit better than I figured it would. Let's see here. Hmm. Oh. No, I would have needed a punch. Okay. Try that again. Oh. Not quite. Plop. There we go. Now, you're very accurate with that top gun, sir. And I kind of envy your skill with that. Hmm. I kind of want to focus you. No, even that far away, you can kill me for that thing. Oh. That was done. How did that let me get away with that? Okay. Wow. Well, goodbye, sir. There we go. Alright, so then... What's the best order here? Because we've got the guy all the way down here. We can technically do that, but at least on time to get away from there. At least, normally you can taunt him and get away with it. Okay. Mm -hmm. And you're trained on me, so... Oh, that actually got you. Nope. Probably not that. Give me a pipe. Oh, that's not working. And then... Aw, oh, so close. Oh. That works. That works. That works. You work. We didn't get to taunt you this time, though. Just a bit of a problem. Am I? Nope. It took a while for that to kill me. That's fine. And I just whiffed. Oh boy. Go away. Oh, he actually noticed me that time. Maybe because of the gun. And you. Let's see here. Really? Can they see through doors if that's what's happening? There we go. Because I swear he's kind of just seen me through the door a few too many times lately. Uh oh. There we go. Now. I definitely feel like throwing the weapon is probably better for a lot of cases, if only because of the fact that... Oh. Oh. Throwing the weapon would be good if I could actually throw it better. Please go away. Thank you. And let's see here. Mm -hmm. Now what is the best option for you two? You especially, you are a problem. I guess I can just taunt you to get out there. Oh. Okay, so yeah, maybe just throwing him to taunt him might be the best option. And then you decide to come out that time. Hmm. I swear the AI game tends to be the most erratic. Let's see. Oh. Okay, no, that's not good. Now they're all just wandering. That definitely didn't help. Here are you. There we go. Goodbye to you. Goodbye. Much better. Now then, you, sir, need to be distracted for long enough to come over here. And you have a pipe now, it's actually a bit easier. I'm just gonna go up. So then, that's room three. 
This would probably be better to do that. Grab a gun, just a taunt. Then he'll just be cycling up and down, so it'll be a little bit easier to kind of just get rid of him. Although not having a gun would probably be better here. Full Q is alright. Okay. Now he's angry. Screw you. Let's see, anger cool Q is probably not great for most of this. Although we're- oh god. Die. There we go. God, that's so good. And just give me this fight. Hey, there we go. Got it. Sometimes being patient is good, but the combos don't really help. Gotta do everything by myself. Uh oh. Oh, that's a problem. Guess we have a boss battle then. Okay, no, can't. Can't deal with him? So either the shotgun. Um. Can you actually see me? Is the problem? Doesn't seem like it. Okay. Oh. Well, shite. That's a problem. Yeah, he can just instantaneously kill you. Okay. No, that's just a stun. Huh. Alright, well this is concerning. Do you want me to kill him? I guess you... no. I guess you just want me to kill him. Noted. But... Whoops. Hmm. So then what do you want me to do then, game? You want me to actively hit him? Oh wait, you can finish him off after you knock him down. So that's the point. Oh, sword doesn't do anything. Sword doesn't do anything. Nope. Did not apparently get the space bar in time. Noted. Nope. Ah. Uh. Okay, game. What exactly are we doing here? There we go. Gotta pop his eyes, so that's a bit better. Alright, later, buddy boy. Yeah, just get it over with. I knew this would end like this. Oh, we're actually saving her? But she's a witness to the crime. Why are we taking her? That seems like it would be a very large breach of confidentiality with this kind of situation, but sure. Okay, we'll take it. Probably only going to get a B plus, B minus on this. Cool, B. New weapon unlocked, though. Oh, B. Cool. Did better than I figured we would. And we got the horse mask of Don Juan. Welcome to the crew, Don Juan. And we got the glass bottle. That's gonna make so much noise. Ooh, we got a fancy restaurant this time, too. Let's see here. Hey, buddy. Hey there, welcome. You don't look all that well, sir. You alright? Are you sure it's okay for you to be out drinking? Alright, then. I'll get you something special. I like tomato sour. Maybe you want it bitter. And there you go, sir. Enjoy. Oh. He did just give it... Oh. No, it's literally right there. Okay. And you can't do anything while in here. Although it is weird that we kind of just use this. Oh. No, he's cute. He's not bleeding. Okay. That's less of a problem. Fuck. And time is at least definitely going faster like this, so that works out. Answers, questions. Well, where are we? We're in the bathroom. Oh, oh, it's you again. Looks like you've been busy since we last met. I see you remember me now, don't you? But you still don't know who I am. You don't even know how introduced us, do you? Oh. 
Why did you come back here? You're not a nice person, are you? You make me sick. A picture is starting to form here. I wonder if it's accurate. Some pieces don't quite seem to fit. Maybe I just don't like the way it looks. I think our time is up, but we'll meet again. Before we go, here's four questions to ponder. Question number one. Do you like hurting other people? Question number two. Who are leaving messages on your answering machine? Question number three. Where are you right now? And the final question. Why are we having this conversation? That's all for now. See you soon. Oh, all the way up to make that. Okay. Well, good evening. This is Lake speaking. We have a job for you. There's a power outage over on 24th Northeast Street. We want you to take care of it. We already sent someone over a while ago, but it seems you didn't do a very good job. Head over there right away. They're expecting you. Keep it quick and clean. Oh, someone's expecting us? That's not a good thing. Well, I mean, if someone's expecting us, then... Probably for the best, we at least entertain them. Fourth chapter, Tension. If you can throw weapons, thank you. Let's see here. Lethal doors. You know what? I'm fine with lethal doors. Oh. Oh, there's dogs now. Get rid of that. Give me the pipe. Not sure I like the fact there are dogs now. That could be a bit of a problem. Because dogs are at least quick. Although, where is it going? Not anywhere I care about. Oh, apparently you care about it, though. Alrighty, well. And I'm going to assume... Does this actually work like glass? Not quite. Fair. Also, where's the... I started there was a guy right in front of the door last time here. I guess he's in there now. Lots of concern. Right, the dog. Gotta be a wee bit careful about the dog. I guess that gave us a weapon this time. Hmm. Let's see. You gonna come down here, buddy? Apparently. Let's see. Let me get the dog. Apparently not. Okay. That was got beyond all leave. Give me that pipe, please. Hmm. Let's see. If I can throw the weapon here. That being no. Okay. What? Give me that. Let's see here. No gun. There we go. Uh oh. Apparently he can see through that. Okay. Or that's just a stored wall. Okay, no, it's that's just a bit of a platform. Okay. Nope, that's the glass window. Goodbye, pupper. Ooh. Goodbye. Let's see here. There we go. Just get a nice super out there. And what else do we have to deal with? Just you in here. So honestly, that's the better. And as long as other people don't fire guns, they're probably going to help us a little bit. Oh, uh, lethal doors is definitely helpful. There we go. Ah! Right, that's glass. No. You're doing well, that's too. That's a shame. There we go. Need that. Here are the pupper. Mm -hmm. Probably should get rid of you early. Now I'm thinking on it. Although it'd be nice if you would come by the door, that would make this a lot easier. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Oh, give me that. There we go. That's a safe room at the very least, but the pupper needs to go. And then, for the gun boy, what do you want to do for us, friend? No, probably shouldn't have hit space there. Okay. 
There we go. And then here. Really? I hit the guy behind him, but I didn't hit him. There we go. Give me that. Go away. A lot of these guys seem kind of blind so far. I'll be honest with you. Oh. Oh, no, I punched him. Weird. I guess I got the click off just after he hit me, so I technically had the weapon dropped by that point. Oh, that's bad. That's very bad, and I can't punch a dog. Okay, fair. There we go. That wasn't working. Alright, so punch, face, do that, then grab the pipe, kill you two off, wait for Pupper to appear. Because I know the Pupper is over there, yeah. Mm -hmm. What's. Oh! You just came outside. Okay, that's fair. There we go. Let's see here. What's a good option for you? Or what's a good option for the pupper? Oh. Pupper had a slight heart attack there. There we go. There we go. Somehow you have a helmet on. Okay. Fair enough, though. Alright, let's see here. You both have guns. You both have melee weapons. Never mind. I can also just whip the attack as well. That's fine. Give me the pipe. There we go. Let's see. I think I heard of these two. I probably want to focus him down first, but also the pupper. Goodbye. Let's see here. Mm. Ah, crap. We'll get this cleanly one of these days. What? Well, cool. We have throwing things for stunning at least. Oh, the dog. I really could keep better eye out on the dog. At least he seems to have a bit more of a random pattern than the other guys do. Goodbye, Hopper. No. Nope. Lethal Doors is handy, though. I am so hard liking Lethal Doors. No. Nope. Silly dog. Let's see here. There we go. Let's knock both of you against the tub. Just fair. Oh, one of the guns actually went outside. I wonder how far he's actually going to come out, though. There we go. He only took one hit that time. I'm getting weirdly lucky. There we go. There we go. And you. Okay, nope, that's all glass. Gotta remember the right side is glass. Gotta remember right side is glass. Give me that. Give me the pipe, please. There we go. Apparently the tub acts as cover, so they can see through the glass, but they can't see over the tub. Anyway, it's kind of just cover. What are you doing this time? Or I can just miss. Okay. Get rid of you. Get rid of you two. Let's see here. Now the pupper's coming. Well, I guess I'll just wait for the pupper. Because the pupper seems to be the more annoying deal breaker when it comes down to it. Nope. Missed the shotgun that time. Oh! He actually noticed me this time. He also noticed me that time because I missed. There we go. Just spill your blood in the bathroom, I'm sure no one will notice. Goodbye to you. Nope. Almost screwed up on the dog. That could not bad quick. And what about you, Mr. Shotgun? You want to come over here? Apparently you do. Or not. Nope. There we go. 
much better. Get me a pipe, please. Apparently I'm that quiet, but hey, so let's go across the pavement is not an upper end of this, so I suppose that's at least a good thing that we can be quiet. There we go. Let's see, samurai sword. Hmm. Oh. There we go. Got it. Domino effect. Okay, so that's probably a good hint that you can't hit more than one target with a uh, thrown weapon, so that's definitely good to know. Hmm. There we go. One down. They're fine with their guy's dead body just being there. There we go. And what about you? You want to investigate this? Because I'm more than happy to elaborate you on the situation. Review. There we go. Now then, I'm just gotta deal with you and the melee guys in here, which is one and two. Oh, you weren't dead. There we go. Then you. There we go. And we got our sword, so we can be a weave during the rest of this level, hopefully. There we go. Let's see. I'm assuming that doesn't count towards a combo. That's fine. Hey, buddy. Are you gonna come up here? There we go. Let's see. That's not enough to lethal. Okay. There we go. Oh. <laughs> okay. That's fine. There we go. Then you won't even look at your friend. Oh. I like missed on that time. Goodbye. Goodbye. And I really can't deal with the knife, can I? Goodbye. Goodbye to you. And goodbye to you. Much better. And probably better to just wait for the gun to come by first. There we go. And then that looks like a problem. That looks like pasta for rescue. Okay. Guess we kind of have to do this. So. <laughs> that looks like a cutscene will trigger as soon as I go into there, so. Probably better to take that quietly. There we go. That should be okay. Alright, then what else can we do for that? Ah. That doesn't look good at all. Somehow I could have expected that. Oh. Hey there, knight. And goodbye to you. Okay, so have to be a little bit careful about the bomb that's wired up to our guy. Goodbye. Goodbye. And goodbye. Let's see here. We can get rid of you decently easily. And get rid of you decently easily. I'm just gotta deal with everybody in here, which is less. I was gonna say less of a concern, but apparently it is. Goodbye. No. Nope. Goodbye. And not quite goodbye. We get a punch off after we die. And. Not enough. Okay. Let's see here. Wop. And wop. Better. Although, how do we disarm the bomb, then? This vent tiger room is just rigged to explode. We're not exactly going to have a very safe time there. There we go. So let's see here. If the room is rigged... Oh, that's... That's a frying pan. That might not be what we need. Let's see here. Options. Options. I'm gonna have to think about this, apparently. Because if we open that door... No. Doing that won't open the door from afar. And no one else is alive. <laughs> hmm. Ah, hey there, Jasper. Yeah, always good to get a quick little quack out of the way. And sadly, I think you got the scare. <laughs> 
So if that room's just rigged to explode then by those two doors, how do I get to it? Mm -hmm. But assuming that the lurking is going okay for you, Jasper, hopefully the mass amount of blood and carnage that we swapped over to from Pokemon hasn't quite dampened the mood just yet. Mm -hmm. What am I supposed to do here? I'm pretty sure... Yeah, if you open up that one, you also die horribly. So, that's not what you're supposed to be doing. I'm back to sub 1000 nice. I mean, that's not a bad thing, Jasper. You have the time to accumulate points again. Well, let's see here. I feel like it wants you to short out the system somehow. Does it really want to use the frying pan for this? No? I guess we have a blunt weapon now. Screw you. Nope. That didn't work. That didn't work at all. There we go. And you. Let's see here. Game, what do you want me to do, though? Because one of our guys is captured. You'd want me to functionally short out the system, right? You're not exactly giving me options here. Mm. Mm -hmm. Can't knock on the door. That would have been a good solution. I can't seem to... Is it because I'm quiet? Yes, it is. Well, solved problem. I just needed to kill our hostage. Although that doesn't really help us, because then as soon as we come into here, they're just going to notice us, right? And I don't think there's any gun we can grab to help us with that. That's a problem. I can't focus on them, though. No, nope, that's gonna work. It's not a hostage situation if there's no hostage. That is technically true. Not gonna fault your logic there. Okay, so you can immediately notice this. There's a bit of a problem. Is that not... Okay, I'm assuming I need a gun for that, then. I guess that makes sense, but... Kind of annoying because I'm trying not to use guns. Hey, buddy boy. Don't mind me. I also don't know why throwing a sword at your face does kill you, but that's fair. Here to view. And. Oh. Right, they cool doors. Sweet. Lovely out in our favor. I guess we do have guns up here that can play, so we can kind of just do. You know, and then you, and then you. Although that gun kind of went underneath the... No? There we go. And apologies for the sound on that. That does admittedly hurt my face. Or that my ears, not my face. There we go. And... There we go. Don't like using guns, but if they're going to kind of require you to use guns to get past there, that's kind of another problem entirely. Let's see. Problem solved. Kind of wish there was a mercy way of doing that, but I guess not. Assuming that's a B minus? Oh, that's actually pretty good. I mean, one of the guys was ours, and he was, he was wired up to a bomb. He wasn't, like, trying to be mean or anything about it. Hey, there, buddy. Oh, hi there, good to see you. I was a bit worried about you. City streets don't seem so safe anymore, you know? I mean, the mistake of being caught. I, I guess that's true, technically. And a business like this is fairly cutthroat. 
Well, with all the guilds and all that, I mean. Don't worry about paying. You're my friend. Your money's no good here. Now have a nice night. Oh, cool. We get free chips. Variables get removed. Blue sends side up. Eh. Yeah. I guess the business is cutthroat enough for that. Also, I wonder how far we are from here. Oh. Yeah, she's still just here. I guess I can't really interact with her, but she's here. It's D from Miami Test Control. We need you. Client in Southwest 104th Street's having burned problems. Try to handle it as quick and swift as you can. Someone else will... Someone else will clean up for you after you leave. Make sure not to bother any of the neighbors. Alright, well, easy enough instructions. So, let's see what this one's like then. I'm assuming more people with guns and probably more good dogs. Full house. Okay, yeah. Guns attract attention. That's why I try not to use them. Walk fast. Hmm. Sure, we'll be a bunny. Let's see here. So, there we go. Give me that. Grab you. Grab you. Dog. Oh, that's not gonna work. That's not gonna work at all. Oh, wow, that worked. How did that work? <laughs> okay, well, skill definitely helping out a little bit. Uh, that's not gonna work at all. What? Oh. There we go. Aw, oh, he did get a gun. Oh, that sucks. Go away. Give me that. Get rid of you. Oh. Guess I can't stun a dog. That would be a little bit silly if you could. Oh, he's actually alive this time? Or he's in the room this time? don't like your variable pathway, sir. Ow. Oh, he actually lives when my crowbar hits the face. Ow. Okay, it's probably just better to do that. There we go. That's a bit better. You need a crowbar. Much better. My favorite line from the movie comes from the movie Speed. Alright, pop quiz. Airport gunman, one hung hostage. He's using her for cover. He's almost... Oh, the dog. Right, I keep forgetting about the dog at times. Well, may as well just wait in here. Oh, that's awful for us. Nope. Screw you, sir. Then you can also go away. And then apparently I can't get the knife guy. That's fine. He's using her for cover. He's also playing. You're 100 feet away, Jack. It's definitely a decent line, although if it's coming from a police officer, that's definitely a little bit more of a concern. Oh. Well, that works. There we go. Let's see here. Dog. Bat. Knife. That's a gun. Well, give me the crowbar. How do I not hit him? Come on. There we go. And then pupper. Get rid of the pupper. Trick or treat, not give me candy. Well, I mean, we are a bit of a robot, so candy might be a little bit harder, but welcome, welcome, all the same. Middle eight. Whoops. That's a problem. Why can I not read that? Magnadius? Okay. Welcome, welcome, Magnadius, and happy Halloween. Hopefully it is going well for you, at the very least. Oh, actually, looking at the time, we're actually getting kind of close to my normal end time. Oopsie daisy. <laughs> but sadly, no candy to share. I've only got bugs. And I don't think most of you humans like bugs. Oh. That didn't work. At all. Well, kind of works. He's just gonna wander. Five, ten ice, let's go. <laughs> well, ten ice is definitely a good number to be at, although it's not gonna give you much of anything. I don't really care for the guns. So where do you want me to go? Just back down? Oh no, uh, I guess I wasn't done yet. Okay. Oh. He blended in a little bit too much with the toilet. 
Certainly. Oh, right. Shotgun. So you, you, then shotgun. Then there's a mass of people in there. You're decently easy to kill. But gotta be a bit careful because the door is gonna make that a little bit tricky. And wow, well, there we go. Then I think you're on your own, right? Oh, you know you're not. How about we try this? Oh, of course I can just whip the head as well. Oh, good job, Jude. You're making everybody proud. Let's see here. So, apparently they're okay with all that, although that's not quite going to work, because now he's just looking at the door. Oh, there we go. There we go. Let's see. Smoker guy? Or not. Okay. It's definitely my reactions that are a little bit slow to it, but... I know we can do it a little better. What? Oh. <laughs> yeah, my reactions definitely need a little bit of work with this. But, what? There we go. Then just poke open the door. Get rid of you. And if you don't see anything, you're probably not going to do anything, so, yeah. Gotta be a little bit more careful about the guns. If I'm just going to go in here as a melee build, pretty much, then it's not going to work out the best for me. There we go. Then you... No. I needed to move. Oh well. Well. And... Goodbye. Then pass that. Oh, no, you noticed it's that time. Hey, buddy boy. You want to come after your friends? Guess not. Ooh. Oh, of course, I threw right beside a guy and I just miss. And goodbye. Much better. Poke open the door. Goodbye. That just taunts him to come up here. That saves that problem for us. Nope. No. That didn't quite work. Bye. Then what about you? You're just gonna come into the plain view? Apparently not. Now let's see here. You go away. And poke the door open. He noticed us. Okay. And he did actually get it. <laughs> Your robots, the guns would have no effect on you. I mean, they don't have an effect on me, but they can hear it. And that's half the problem. And sadly, we're not exactly the robot at the moment, so... The guy that we're controlling is very effective by guns. Well... I'm assuming he's gonna notice that I'm coming here, so... Goodbye. Then you... Ow. <laughs> I guess he noticed us walking in there, so... Also, no problem there. Well... And then... Goodbye to you. Poke that open. No one saw us that time. Huh. Oh. Never mind, he saw us that time. Just took a second. And then you, sir. Goodbye. Is that a glow stick? I'm not sure how helpful a glow stick will be to us, but... Maybe. Oh. That didn't work. Anyways. There we go. Goodbye, gunner boy. Let's see here. There we go. Goodbye. I believe that's just a pipe, so we're good there. Now we just gotta deal with this room. That room's a little bit scary. Much better. I know you don't like using guns, but they sometimes do help with lurking enemies out with the noise. Yeah, that is true. But we can also just do that. Or I can stay locked on him because he was still alive. Well, nope. 
There we go. That's a bit better. Maybe I should just use them for luring tactics. Because we're kind of getting at a point now that there's more than enough people to actually make good use of it. Oh, that's a glass bottle. That's not a glow stick. Okay. That's a bit different then. Poke that out. Swap. So that didn't work at all. Goodbye. They're just right beside each other. Yeah, the full response. Anna Reeves' character gives the hypothetical to shoot the hostage. Oh, you're still alive. There we go. Take her out of the equation. Go for the good wound. Can't get to the plane with her clear shots, who, which a cop friend asked him, what do you say? You're deeply nuts. Mm. Well, I don't know the movie off the top of my head, but... Oh. Well, that should surprise me, at the very least. Hey, buddy boy. Goodbye. That's better. Yeah, we can get our crowbar back. Look at us. Now then, let's see here. Probably just best to do that. Then he'll come out here. Because he's a nerd. Or he's not gonna come out here. No, nope, that didn't work. <laughs> Playing cool. Now I'm gonna get that achievement. What? Also, Lethal Doors is a great mess, too. Yeah, I do like Lethal Doors. I didn't have that on last time, but I kind of wanted to try out the faster walk speed this time around, because we just got it. But I'll probably stick to Lethal Doors going forward, because that is overall just more helpful. Is he actually dead? Okay, he is dead. Let's see here. Bop. There we go. Mirror problem. That's not going to work out for us very well. There we go. That's a bit better. Lure them with a gun and watch them run up to the doors. Yeah, that tends to help a little bit. Let's see here. How did they not see or hear that? Oh, that didn't work. Hey, buddy. Let's see. Just him left? Did you not notice that at all? Are you that blind? I guess this counts as a wall, but... Okay, that works too. Had to use a bit more gun than I'm used to using, but... Oh, I'm blind. Where's our car again? There we go. That's better. Yeah, well, faster walk speed is helpful in some instances if you're trying to sneak up on somebody, but... Lethal Doors does have a little bit more flexibility in terms of your ability to kill something. Hmm. That's not a great score. That should probably get us... Yeah, that's kind of what I was thinking. Kind of died a bit too much there. Oh, Dennis. Hi, Dennis. How are you today? Ooh, Magnums. Magnums are fun. And we're back to the pizza place. Hey, buddy. Good evening, how are you doing? You look like a bit distracted, some guy you worried? These are harsh times we're living in, I know. Haven't seen many customers lately. Maybe they've lost the taste for pizza. Maybe it's time to close shop once and for all. Anyway, it's got your order right here. Take care now. Alright, well, thank you for the pizza, buddy. Boy. And we do have her with us, which I'm still a little bit confused about. Yeah, it would be nice to get free pizza, but I think that's mostly it's payment that's in there. Hi, it's Don from Hotel Blue. We need you tonight. Our receptionist went home due to some stomach problems. And we have some VIPs who will be staying with us today. Make sure you give them a great stay. That'll be your top priority this evening. Now get going. Alrighty then, get to deal with some very important people. Oh. Hi there, janitor. That's not subtle at all. I guess we'll do this one last chapter just because this is usually when I end off. Let's see, what does Dennis do? Dennis starts with a knife. That's honestly fine. We can just deal with the punching at the start, I think. Oh, there's just a stash of guns in there. 
Oh. Well, hey buddy. Goodbye. Just everybody has a gun, Jesus. I am trying to do less gun. But you're bigger. I don't know if I'll have an option with you, actually. Because you look like a bioengineered soldier. Oh god. Okay, oh, hey, noted, they're a little bit tankier. Maybe that's why they gave you a stash of guns off the start. Well, let's see here. Especially because they're just lock whapping that open. That is not smart, my dude. Oh. There we go. I mean, if they're not giving me an option, I kind of have to use it, so. I'll probably dip out soon, kind of want to do an early stream since I won't be able to tonight since Halloween. Probably. That sounds fair, Jasper. I know I'll be wrapping up as soon as we finish this off. Just because I need to go grocery shopping, but... Pop. Give me that, please. Let's see here. Does he count? Oh. Apparently one assault round shot is not a click on it. Noted. It's possible to do a gun run since you can only kill the guy with guns. Ah. Fair. Please die. Well, I guess we better get used to him then. Oh. There we go. And then you. Oh. How am I missing that? God damn, how am I missing that? Poorly. Okay. Gotta make decisions. So yeah, I gotta go lay down and think about it first. Alright. Chat with you later, Jasper. Hopefully you come down to a decision quickly. Let's see here. So the waiters are definitely people we got to worry about. So are the guys with guns already. So then, best option would probably be to get... I'm not even sure if that's helpful. A shotgun might be better. There we go. And are you just going to come up here on your own? I guess not. I guess no one's just gonna mind the dead body in the middle of the white carpet. Okay. Let's see here. Okay, no, they're like trained on me. Okay. That's not good. Well, that helped. Anyone else actually alive in there? I don't think so. Probably should grab a new gun now. Huh. Am I missing someone? Um, no, I can't leave yet. In the second game, you can kill the fat guys with the Tony mask, but I don't know if it works in this one. What my life? Okay. I haven't really tried it yet, but... I kind of have to see. Because I know I haven't actively tried the Tony mask just yet, so... It actually wanted me to fill the bystanders. Okay. And then where do you want me to get the elevator? You know. So what do we got in here then? Wants me to go out the window? What? Oh, the janitor. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's a new mechanic. That's a very new mechanic. Okay. But why do you want me to do this? The janitor is like right there. This seems like a bad idea. Yeah, because the janitors can see us. That's clearly the problem. Oops. That's not what you want to do. That's really not what you want to do. Give me that gun, please. Me that gun. And I guess brain prank? Oh, that's not good. <laughs> so it really wants me to just expose myself to these janitors. Because this is a little bit too obvious of a plot point that they're watching, but like I'm assuming they can't be killed is the thing. There we go. There's one. There's two. Give me that. 
That's another assault rifle, so probably not the greatest for this, but... Oh, goodbye. They haven't attacked me yet, but this game seems to focus more on information compared to anything else. There we go. Ow. I don't have the bullets. That's not good. Well, I guess it doesn't need me to shoot at that, but... Well, don't necessarily like the random Uzi. Uzi does not seem like a great gun for this. Oh. Oh. One of them died at the door. No, not one of them didn't die at the door. Okay. Realistically, if they saw you, they would have alerted everyone. That is true. I suppose that's true. I guess it's just concerning. Oh. So apparently I have to kick the door into them for the cat's Noted. Okay. And then there's him. Which I'm assuming needs to die. Yeah. Okay. And then we just leave? Okay. It's probably a teaching thing, showing the play that people can see you through windows. They kind of already taught us that for Because we've had a few instances of those windows being able to get some of the snipers down. But either way, we got through the level. It wasn't too bad. And we got a pretty good grade for that, too. I kind of figured it messed it up a little bit, but... Hey, we've got George, we got the giraffe, which is just a reskin of the horse head, but that's honestly fine, they're basically the same animal. So let's just grab our, I think this is the VHS store. Hey there. Hey, my man, boy, am I glad to see you. Have you been following the news about the killings? Now, this is top secret, you can't tell anyone, but I have a friend who's in the police force. He told me there's rumors going around. There could be more than one part, maybe a whole bunch. A group of people wearing masks killing Russians. It's like it's from a movie or something, right? Well, I think it's fascinating. Right? So just grab any movie you want. It's on the house, that's what friends are for. Oh, just one of the right at the front of the store? Okay. Fine by me. But I think that is where I'll probably... I'm not sure what movie I got. I'm going to assume Fast and Furious 5, because we're probably supposed to be playing this game quickly. Oh, she actually has clothing now. That's nice. Although she doesn't know what we look like now, and that's a bit concerning. But, since I've been going for a while and I do need to do some grocery shopping, I think that's probably where I'll leave it off for now. Especially considering the time frame. I need to get up and move around. So, I think that's about all the juice I've got. This is the end of my normal streaming week, obviously, just as a heads up. But I'll be back live again next Friday with Golden Sun, I believe we nailed down for RPG Day. So we'll be back Friday with some Golden Sun. Saturday we'll be starting either... Actually, no, we'll be continuing Hotline Miami for Saturday, and then Dark Souls in the evening. So, kind of the rough schedule for now. Let's just see who we can raid really quick. Let's use that. Let's just see who's actually on Twitch, because I'm not exactly going to be here for a long time past this, but may as well get my view for now. Wow. Following. And a pleasure to have you there. Uh, Magnadeus. Always oh, nice to see some new people pop on by. Let's see here. Zin is going. Sunny is going. Massey is going with the Jackbox. That's probably okay. Sure, let's go bug Mousy. Raid 1, Raid 2, and Raid Mousy Fuzz. Because I'm assuming she's going to be going for a fly on a Sunday. But, do want to thank everyone for stopping by. It's a pleasure to have you hanging out in the freezer. And at least from my side, I'll be a little bit, I'll be a little bit unavailable as I'm going to be going outside shortly after this. But for now, it's been a pleasure having you. Talk to you all later. Bye bye.